Hey guys, I'm driving through Norwalk, Ohio and had to stop to take a closer look at this. It's a lifted 4-2 smart car for sale at a dealership. You can see it has some gnarly off-road tires, a roof rack, and a digital camo wrap. We've got some LED lights mounted up front, along with a winch. I don't know enough about smart cars to tell you how this one's lifted, but let's have a look underneath. Okay, I can see it's still rear-wheel drive, not four-wheel drive. Here, you can see the hidden winch, 5,000 pounds. I can't tell if there's a spacer to bring the wheel out to make more room for these tires. Here's the suspension. It looks like a factory strut with a Daystar type spacer under the spring to get some lift. Check out the tread on these tires. I wonder if these are DOT approved for highway use. It looked like they belong in a side-by-side. Canati -side. Mongrel, 28 by 10. Let's go look at the rear. We've got some duct work here. It goes from the engine through the wheel well and fender to the snorkel. It looks like the original shock was replaced with an aftermarket air shock. And there's the line for the air. I wonder if they had to trim the opening here to get some extra clearance. I don't think it would be open on the back edge like that, but it's hard to tell. It's a really clean cut. I've never looked under a bone stock Smart 4.2, so I'm not sure what's been modified here. It looks as if this whole rear subframe is lifted with spacers. I see a black cylindrical mounts between it and the body. Here's a look at the rear spring. I can't tell if that's original. It doesn't look to have any aftermarket spacers above it or below it. The roof rack looks good. I can't see much inside except that it still has the full interior. I see the winch remote up on the dash. How about the price? $97.50. For a custom lifted 2012 42 Pure with 25,000 miles. Would you buy this vehicle? Let me know why or why not in the comments, as well as what would you use this for? Oh, and it's sitting out here at BNN Automotive on Route 250 in Norwalk, Ohio, if you'd like to buy it. If you like off-road or strange vehicles, subscribe and check out some of my other videos.